So yesterday, the new running back spoke, Leroy. All right, Dolphins got themselves a new backfield, one that apparently, uh, you know, hopefully runs further than social distance. I mean, it was bad last year. There's proof that they have. They've, it's proof that they've been competent running backs in the NFL. So. Yep, yep, yep. So a much better, a much better spot for them, for sure. But uh, they had you know, Jordan Howard spoke to the media a little bit yesterday. Matt Breida spoke to the uh, – to the to the reporters yesterday. Now Matt Breida, this dude's Ricky Bobby uh, Leroy. This dude likes to go fast. All right, <laughs> talking about his Lamborghini that he bought, all that type of stuff. But he is uh, he was asked yesterday that uh, the idea of who is the fastest player in the NFL. Now for for everybody's uh, info, Matt Breida, according to Next Gen Stats, he uh, he was clocked at the fastest time in the NFL yes, uh, last year where he had a, uh, his 22.3 miles per hour speed that went down. So he's been back-to-back years, Leroy. Where he has been clocked based on these next-gen stats as the fastest player in the NFL. And so all these people talking about uh, Cheetah or anybody else, he's saying, baloney, it's me. And he put this, uh, he wanted to make this clear yesterday. Here's Matt Breida. Who's the fastest guy in the NFL? Where do you rank? Oh, man, you guys know the answer to this question. You guys... See the next gen stats, you know. What I mean, for the for the past two years, you guys, you know, I always, you know, uh, get to this question, and uh, you know, until someone, you know, beats my time, beats me out in, the, in that same year, then you know, I'm still the fastest guy. He doesn't want to hear it, Leroy. He's numero uno, fastest legs in all the NFL, Matt Breida. Now, question: You've seen Matt Breida play? And you've seen my man from Kansas City play. Right? Yep. And I'm going to ask you this. Who do you think is the fastest? Look, I test. No, 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 no. I test, I would think Cheetah's faster. He's the Cheetah. But. I am not a I am not a next gen expert. If the next gen say it, the stats are the stats, the stats are the stats. Okay. No, okay. no bueno. No. But why? He ain't, fa- he ain't faster than Tyreek Hill. There ain't no twenty twenty two point three miles per hour. And Tyreek Hill's always at t- Tyreek Hill's always in the open, and he don't have to run that fast. Oh, so you're saying he's like always he, uh, coasting. You say you're saying he's just he's he's bringing bringing down the Jets a little bit. Yeah. Hmm. Dude ran when he was running with T.O. ran like a four four, and coasted for almost ten yards. Do you know how fast that is? Matt Breida, due to his disappointment senior time, was not invited to the NFL Combine. He performed well at his pro day, where he ran a four three eight forty yard dash. Okay, four three eight. Four three eight. That's. Do you know how? And they say Tyreek Hill can run four two. That's what he claims. Yes. That's like a tenth of a. A tenth. Tyreek Hill on Matt Breida back uh, back in 2018 says there's only one cheetah in the league. That's just a nickname, though. I mean, like, you're not actually a cheetah. Like, he knows that he doesn't have spots, and he he's not like chasing gazelles, right? Huh? The, no. Tyreek Hill says uh, there's only, quote, there's only one cheetah in the league. Like, he knows he's not actually a cheetah, right? Like, this is an animal. <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> wait. Wait. Here's what's amazing to me. I know everybody's going to sit here and, and listen to this. It's amazing that that is coming from you. You're questioning <laughs> <laughs> somebody's silly sauce. Right? <laughs> That's what's amazing. He goes, oh, geez, this is mean. He goes, you can't be a cheetah and run a 4-4-8 or whatever you run. Damn. Right. Right. I'm telling you. If you put a poll question, who's faster, Tyreek Hill or Matt Breida? Most people are going to say Tyreek Hill, but isn't that just because Tyreek Hill's more famous? No. Because he's faster. Okay, so let me get this straight. Let me get this straight. So 
if Matt Breida just changed his Twitter handle to at Roadrunner, people just think he's faster? If what now? If he just ch- – because Tyree Kill, his Twitter handle is at Cheetah. So if, Ty- if, if Matt Breida just changed his Twitter handle to at Roadrunner, he's just faster? What is it, marketing? Man, I've seen them both play football. Matt Breida's fast. He ain't Tyree Kill fast. According to Matt Breida, a bunch of people are in the uh, uh, want to race him already, including, and this kind of annoyed me. Uh, apparently, Kalen Balaj wants to race him in a hundred yard dash. Now, here's the thing, Kalen Balaj. <laughs> Wait, is he gonna stop after two and a half? Yeah, like Kalen Balaj. I don't want to hear about Kalen Balaj doing any super challenges with here's anybody what's gonna on happen. the team. You ready? Here's what's gonna happen. Because of the av- the yards per carry of Kalen Balaj, he gonna run like forty yards and think he ran two hundred. Say, hey man, that's only forty yards. It felt like a hundred. <laughs> can we hear? Uh, can we hear this, Robbie, about Kalen Balaj wanting to race him? Oh yeah, I mean it's a it's great, you know, great honor to be you know um, known as you know one of the fast guys in the league, and uh, you know just coming in and draft, you know, it's pretty cool because it shows that you know no matter where you came from, you know you can still be one of the top guys in the NFL. And, uh, you know, me and Jakeem haven't really talked about it too much, but, uh, you know, Kalen got on me yesterday. You know, he wants to race in 100 meter and stuff. So, uh, no, I might have to race him. But, uh, you know, I think me and Jakeem will eventually race, but uh, we haven't talked about that yet. I mean, listen, I want to see a race between him and Jakeem Grant. Kalen Balaj doing any type of challenges. I don't know, man. Here, here, here's, here's what sucks about – here's what sucks about these things here. Because I picture the other guys being a little quicker, right? So they can get up to their top speed faster than Matt. And what ends up happening is they get a lead and subsequently win the 40, even though Matt Breida may have reached the top speed. Does that mean he's the fastest? I think it should mean he's the fastest. No, just because you run the fastest and you don't run the fastest. If you don't run the fastest time, you're not the fastest. You should be able to. It is a 100-yard field. If you can run faster over the span of 100 yards, you're the fastest. Here, how about this? I don't know how fast I am in 100. Because I literally think every time it looked like I may run, for more than 60 yards, I collapse out of sheer exhaustion. <laughs> what is the longest run of your career? 86? Like 70, 70. 70. Well, yeah, you, had a, you had a reception. That, that was like 70 yards. Yeah. Did you hit, the, did you yeah. hit the, uh, the old oxygen tank after that? No, that doesn't help. Well, I see people doing that. Yeah, it's just stupid. It doesn't help. <laughs> I love when the fat guys do it. It's the best. I, like oh get a man. get a get so, a fumble recovery and go the other way. Look, he said, "Do you realize you are arguing two different things? One guy is faster at a forty-yard dash, the other one is f- faster top speed." Exactly. Yeah. That, but but it's not two different things because in football, the guy who's faster at the forty is gonna have uh in at the end of the day is gonna be more productive using his speed in football. Because football is a burst sport. Now, if he was running a 200, if Matt Breed was running a 200, okay, and he had time to get up to that top speed, that's fine. But in football, it's all about burst. So that top end speed, unless you get wide ass open, don't matter. I mean, average, I mean, what, he averaged five yards per carry last year? Or in his I first didn't three say seasons? it was garbage. I'm not saying he's garbage. Just wait, wait, wait. Don't, just because I said he's not the fastest, didn't say he wasn't good. Okay? But him to say he's faster than Tyreek Hill. Okay? Here's what would happen. There will come a distance to where Matt Breida's speed would matter. But I doubt that when comparing the two speeds in football, that it's ever going to matter against Tyreek Hill. Matt Breida says... Because Tyreek Hill is so explosive that how far is he going to have to run before Breida can catch him? I think it should be 100 yards. But that's not football. It's 40-yard dash. 
Ah, what if it's a? What, they both run for. They both. They there's both there's, run for there's big only been in the history of football. There's only been like five 99 yard touchdowns. So the, what good is that? So fine, 80 yards. <laughs> Here's All Matt right. Breda on the difference between football fast and race fast, but saying that he'll win either. I mean, it's it, it's football. I think you play football with a, uh, you know football with an actual football and shoulder pads on. So I mean, I, I'm more than welcome to race anyone out shoulder pads. You know, it'll be easier for me. But um, you know, you play football with all the equipment on. So you know, uh, you know, I want to see a lot of guys that can run that fast with uh, football in their hand and uh, full equipment. I like that. That's like awesome. Floyd that's Mayweather. That, that's like Floyd Mayweather who's duping people and saying like, "Oh, you want to fight eight ounce clubs? All right, sucker." I'm a fan. I like this guy. All right. I'm a fan, Leroy. All right. All right. You, you called him a fastest. liar? Huh? Is he second fastest? Could be. But you Could don't think be. anybody touches... And nobody touches the cheetah. No. No. You know the cheetah gets quite exhausted in the animal kingdom. Fugazi and so did runner. he. He couldn't even... He barely made it 40 yards. Against <laughs> T.O. <laughs> <laughs> 